Hello everybody, Tony with the Fralada Group. Today I'm taking you through a Heartland Milestone 386BH. This is a brand new lineup that we just brought in. This is the first one that I've done a video on, so I'm probably going to forget some stuff or miss some stuff. So come on out and check this out. It's definitely a sight to see, and I'm going to jump right into the specs. We are 43 foot 7 inches in overall length, weigh approximately 13,000 pounds, unloaded with a GVW of 15,500 pounds. We haul 50 gallons of fresh water, 120 gallons of gray, 80 gallons of black. We have a 6 gallon gas and electric water heater. And we have comfortable sleeping for up to eight people. Now those tank holding capacities are because this is a full two bathroom floor plan and a full two bedroom floor plan. We have four slide outs. Again, 43 foot, seven inches in overall length. Let's start with some of the specs. We have our fully painted contoured front cap that really helps with the towing with short bed trucks. We have our Rotoflex pin box. We also have a Lippert Ground Control 3.0 six-point auto leveling system with the keypad right up here in front for taking it up off your truck and then initiating that initial auto leveling process, which remembers your hitch height. So when you're done, it'll return it right back to where you unhook from for easy hooking up when you go. We have our first of two full pass-through doors here. This one houses all of your water connections. This is where you do your tank fill. You have your hot and cold shower, 110 plugs, cable and satellite lines. We have our water heater and our furnace exhaust on the non-enjoyment side of the trailer. We have our WeatherGuard Four Seasons package with heated and enclosed underbelly. We have two air conditioning units up on the roof, which are both central and ducted. As we walk around the back here, you're going to see all of your feet deployed. We have 16-inch aluminum wheels wrapped in 14-ply tires. We have a rear hitch for carrying any bike racks or luggage racks. You'll notice the door here on back goes right into your second bathroom from the outside. That limits the amount of running through the trailer just to use the restroom. It is a porcelain bowl toilet here in back and we'll kind of see this bathroom in its entirety when we go in. But there's your bathtub, your shower, your toilet, your sink, and the door going into your back bedroom. This is a full profile trailer up in front, which means you won't have to duck and you have no step up around the bed. And here in back, it almost looks like a Pez machine. Someone walking out that door is going to look like those old Pez candies where you, the pellet falls out. At least that's my analogy. We're pre-wired for your rear camera right below that center marker light. Ladder going all the way up onto your fully walkable roof with the full radius edges. Coming around this side, you have your fourth slide out, which is in your back bedroom. We also have an exterior refrigerator and cooktop and a ton of storage. Check out all the storage on this side of the trailer. Two seven gallon, 30 pound propane tanks, your outdoor speakers, your power awning with your LED light strip up against the side of the coach so you don't have to have the awning out to utilize that light. It can be in and you get plenty of light. So you notice we have no porch light, so that's very important. This is done in our Asdell exterior sideboards. If you don't know what that is, check it out, but it's definitely an upgrade. We're a welded aluminum construction with smooth fiberglass exterior with foam block insulation. On both doors, we have our LCI solid steps with that big 13 inch top step and four steps going on up into the trailer. There's a good look at your nice fancy aluminum wheels. And let's go inside. As we go inside, we're gonna have residential style flooring, no carpet anywhere in this, which works really good for kids. We have our triple reclining sofa with our armrests that pop out and go back in for easy storage. You can see that one's out. All three seats do recline. We have our residential fridge with our wine refrigerator. And if you look at the pictures, you'll see it fully opened up. In the freezer area, which is the both bottom doors, it's full of drawers. So if you're an organization freak like myself, it'll work out pretty good for you. Nice full pantry here, just to the left of it. As I spin a little bit more, we have our table, which you could buy some extra bar stools to go at the other side. And then you have a four seated table. There's your TV playing off of our high definition off-air antenna, which is up on the roof. So that's free TV. We get about 48 channels here. Look at the decor. The decor is very nice and light and updated. As I turn to the kitchen, we have a full wraparound kitchen with plenty of counter space. All your upper cabinets, nice large microwave. You have your oven and cooktop, which is covered in glass for increased counter space if you're not using it. We have our one large stainless steel farmhouse style sink with our residential faucet with sprayer. Cabinets all the way down, lots of drawers, different color cabinets up on top, which really breaks it up and makes it look very, very nice and classy. Let's go to the back room, which closes off with a big rolling door, so their bedtime does not become your bedtime. 
Here we have two bunks. That top bunk will lift up and peg into the holes to come up off their head. So they can sit down there and watch TV. As we turn a little bit more, we have a booth that breaks down into a bed and then another top bunk, which will go up and peg into those holes as well. You notice the ladder going up in our fully sleepable loft with a railing there. Cabinets here for any clothes or any toy stores. And then you have little shoe cubbies down below. Notice there's no carpet. It's all the woven infinity style flooring. Keep nice and clean, especially with kids. As we go back here, here's your rear door that we were looking in. Shelves going all the way up in this corner. There's your sink, which is residential height. Nice mirror, porcelain toilet, bathtub, and shower. Lots of room back here. The two bathrooms helps with the amount of people this thing can sleep. There's a nice large door. We'll walk back through the main living. We're going to go up the steps here and into our master bedroom, which has its own private door. We have a king-size bed, residential-style dresser. As we turn in here, I'll continue to go around that closet when it's opened up is one big room. In behind that big white door is your washer dryer hookups. You have cubbies down each side of the bed and you have windows on each side of the head. Lots of walk around room right here at the foot of the bed and all the way down the sides. Give you a glimpse into here. Like I said, you could probably walk around and through here. Tons of storage, washer dryer hookups. And there's your other portion. Shelf all the way up on top for any shoes, LED lights at which light it up so you can see in there. Again, huge king size bed, USBs at both sides of the bed. Your own thermostat up here, a location for your TV if you desire to have one in the bedroom. There's your residential style dresser with a window above, which opens up 50% for any circulation that you want. Now, as you go back out this door, we're gonna go into our bathroom, which is up here by the master bedroom, so you don't have to walk in back and no one from back is walking up here to use a restroom. We have our trifold glass doors, nice large shower pan, residential style faucets, counter heights, and medicine cabinets. Porcelain toilet up here as well. So porcelain toilets in both locations. Bang for the buck, this one is hard to beat. Pan around down here a little bit. This is definitely a family pad trailer for the growing family, lots of kids, kids with friends, or even full-time living. This has a one-year warranty on the house and a three-year on the structure. We'll go back outside now. Kind of stand back here a little bit. All right, everybody, this is our Heartland Milestone 386BH. We're 43 foot 7 inches in overall length, weigh approximately 12,995 or 13,000 pounds empty with a GVW of 15,500 pounds, 50 gallons of freshwater capacity, 120 gallons of gray, 80 gallons of black with a 6 gallon gas electric water heater, and sleeping up to eight people. We have our two ACs up there on the roof with our high definition off air antenna. Full radius rolled roof, nice large awning with LED light strip, fully enclosed and heated underbelly, six point auto leveling system, two full bathrooms, outdoor cook station and refrigerator, two entrances, one right into the bathroom, rear hitch, painted front cap that's contoured for short bed towing, spare tire there underneath. Give us a call, 209-404-2200. Check us out on the web at www.referralautogroup.com. As always, we're not strong arm salespeople. We're not going to hustle and hassle you to you buy. We're going to educate you and leave that buying decision completely up to you. Find that hard to believe. Come on in and check us out. If you feel anything different, let me know. If you've been in, then you know that's true. We're a full service facility. We have our full service center for all of our clients' warranty, repair, and upgrade needs. We also outfit that complete tow vehicle with everything it needs to tow a trailer safely down the road. We're the home of the forever warranty. It's a lifetime nationwide warranty. So come on in and check us out. As always, thanks for watching. We truly appreciate it. We look forward to meeting you. Take care. Bye-bye.